Look at that scrappers. Nice night to scrap. Now this, this faucet was in the garbage at the insurance company I cleaned. They kind of, they hit the faucet. I'm the, I'm the guy that cleans it. And when they shut them off, they're not, they're always crooked whenever they shut them off. And the insurance company remodeled. And these were in a crash, so. Score! Of course I'm taking them home. These are brass, that's heavy. It's like, maybe three pounds, four pounds right there. But These fittings here are brass. You can just see the nice brassiness of them. And this stuff here is always copper. Now this pressing piece here is also brass. This press end fitting here. So this stuff here is all copper. And this end piece here is brass. But I'm not taking that off. I'm going to call this number two copper. Even, you know, because it's got like a chrome coating on it. But you can see it's copper. It's copper colored. So got two of these same thing this piece here is brass but all this is copper you can see it where they where they cut it so there's brass brass copper and this piece here sometimes this is plastic that's plastic this is rubber um throwing that out this piece in here is usually either stainless or brass i can tell this one's oh, it was all clogged up that's why that sink was running so funny. This is brass. Now, if you guys are uh, big time pot smokers or something, these are good to save for your pipes. I don't do any drugs. I like my I like my beer, so I'll just be scrapping that. I like my beer. And um, this one is made by American Standard. Their faucets are usually pretty high quality. So there probably isn't too much more rubber or steel in this. I can probably just go ahead and throw this right in the brass bucket the way it is. But they're jerks at my scrap yard. And they want to see it. If they see it like this, they're going to assume there's rubber O-rings in it. And <clears throat> oh, That wasn't that too. Free tap water. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, my, my scrapyard, they're just going to assume that there's like metal and rubber in here and they won't give me the full brass price of it. <clears throat> I pulled out. That's all brass straight through, I bet. Yep. All brass. Piece of rubber here. And if this is brass... No! I gotcha. Some plastic or rubber. And I bet everything else in here is brass too. Yeah, but my scrapyard, if I brought it down as a whole faucet, they would assume that there was rubber and plastic and stuff in it, and they wouldn't give me full brass price. They'd call my whole bucket brass bearing, which would really suck. And a lot of times they'll say, it's brass bearing as they're throwing it into the brass bin and it's like too late to snatch it out of their hand and throw it back in my truck so I always make sure I try to get as much of the rubber and plastic out as I can so that was it, that was pretty easy nice score got a whole bunch of brass and even these caps That's brass. I want to see if I can get one of these out to prove it or to make sure. Came out. Is that brass too? It's way too heavy to be aluminum. And they want to make something like that out of stainless. That bent kind of easy actually. So not too bad, not too bad. Got a nice little handful of brass for the brass bucket. And some number two copper for the number two copper bucket. So, just remember guys, scrap is everywhere. All you gotta do is find it, sort it, and hoard it. So, thanks for watching and 
don't forget to subscribe.